Hello, hello. Right, well, this is a quick update. It's an update video, uh, really on Facebook and what's been going on. I got a little bit of a break, so I got a bit of CGI going on behind me. There you go, CGI yard scraping behind me. Um, right, so this is a bit of a brief update on Facebook. and I, I, I'm not gonna say too much, because I've still got some issues to deal with. So as you well know, my Facebook account was hacked. Uh, from the 3rd of January, I was completely removed from that account and I had no access to it. I couldn't even write on it or anything. Um, as of yesterday, I managed to get back some access to that account, which enabled me to get rid of the reels that were put on there by the hacker. The, the reels are basically short videos and what they've been trying to do is monetize those, okay? Uh, so I, I have access to write on the account at the moment, okay, and it is me operating it. However, the hacker still has some access to control. Um, I'm not going to go into this details now because I've got someone working on this and the reality is, you know, possible the hackers look at this video now laughing at me. Okay, so at the moment I'm in control. It's possible I might lose that, but we're working on it. Um, it has been very frustrating and upsetting, I can't deny that. Thank you for everyone who sent me messages. There's a load of you who've messaged me, all sorts of support. Some of you have messaged me through Facebook Messenger when it was hacked. Unfortunately, I didn't get those till yesterday because there is no direct way of messaging me through Facebook once the hacker gets involved. Um, so if you want to message me off of Facebook, if it, if it happens again, message me through Instagram or email me. <coughs> um, because that, that's the way I will get your message. Um, and in fact, Instagram sort of took the place of Facebook while it was down. Um, so yeah, I want to say a big thank you to everyone who sent me messages. Uh, Sylvia, thank you for the chocolates, really appreciate it. Um, and everyone else who kind of jumped in, offered me a bit of advice and stuff. Um, like I said, this is still ongoing, it's not over yet. And um, once I'm confident that, we, that I'm fully back in control of this, I will then post a proper video explaining <coughs> what's going on and what's happened and maybe how you can avoid this situation yourself. Um, okay, so that's Facebook and uh, ongoing, like I said. Uh, now, the thing about Facebook is that, so you, you guys who watch me on video might catch up with me maybe uh, once or twice a week with videos, but generally what I've been doing over the past, well, since, so I launched Funky Farmer Facebook in 2015. I only found that out the other day, I didn't realize. Um, and I've been putting things on there. For those of you who don't follow me on Facebook, um, this is what I do. I basically generally upload stuff that you don't see on YouTube. So a lot of the time I do things, little pieces, bits and pieces that you wouldn't, it's not worth me videoing. You know, it's maybe a nice, a nice view or something like that. Or maybe, hey, look, this is what I've had for tea tonight, <laughs> things like that. Um, my wife's lovely, um, you know, pie or something like that, or roast dinner, or, you know, just, I, I share jokes and I share the news of the farming world. Uh, sorry, I'm moving out of the way because the CGI is coming by, look. Get out of the CGI, get out of the way of the CGI. Um, so, yeah, so I, I put a lot of things on Facebook that you wouldn't normally see on, on my YouTube. And I really enjoy that. And also, I really enjoy how it interacts. So. Um, I've missed that and at the moment I'm not, I'm not keep moving. I'm not hundred percent sure when I'm gonna go back on their regularly posting because I'm I'm sort of lost my confidence a little bit on there at the moment because of the ongoing situation. Um, so I will just give you a couple of uh, bits of updates now which you might have missed because because it wasn't on uh, Facebook. So uh, you hopefully you've seen the video but there's uh we've we me and Harry have planted a tree. Um as part of the 40 trees for 40 years. Now, I've also sent out all the YouTubing ones. And if you if you do go on Facebook, you can look up Gareth Wynn Thomas and, and um, Sheep Game have both posted videos of them receiving uh, their tree. Um, and also Cotland Farm has also done a, a, a post on Instagram. Um, Tom pempton has been back in touch. He was a really late one to reply. He didn't reply to me when I asked him if he wanted one. And then he and then he texted me the other day. He said, oh, what, I bloody want a tree. And he had too much going on, I think, and he just forgot. Anyway, so he's back on the list now. So we have got 
13 YouTubers uh, planting trees, including myself. Um, <clears throat> the rest of the trees are going to be out. The closing date for that application is the 20th. And I will be having to pull the names out of a hat because I've had so many people apply for trees. I'm going to have to section it down into, into uh, different parts of the country, you know, Ireland and Northern Ireland, Scotland, Wales, England. And then I'm going to have to pull, pull out the number for each one out of a hat because it's really hard for me to pick who's best to get one because there's so many worthy causes. There's so many people on there that are, have sent stories about why they should have one and genuine, you know, in memory of their late departed partner or, the, you know, plant it for their children or whatever. And I kind of, I wish I had trees and trees and trees to give away, but I have a limit of 40 because financially it's costing me quite a lot. Um, so I hope if you're watching this and you don't get a tree, I hope you understand that there's only so much I can do. However, that doesn't stop you going out and grabbing a tree yourself from somewhere and planting one. Because, hey, if anything comes out of this, let's hope it's an initiative to actually plant one yourself. You can do that yourself anywhere. All right. Um, and finally, I just thought I'd say that I am hoping to be at Lama on the 18th, which is this Thursday coming. Uh, going up with Farmer P. Me and him, we haven't, I haven't spoken to him. I've been a bit busy. I saw him the other day with a tree. I forgot to mention it. Uh, we haven't arranged to go up together, but I'm sure we will. Um, I will be somewhere at Lama walking around. I haven't arranged to meet anywhere. And maybe Farmer P will put something on Facebook. We haven't arranged to be anywhere because we're not affiliated with anyone up there. We're just going as visitors like all you guys. So um, <laughs> my ticket costs a fortune. It's free. <laughs> so if any of you want to go to Lama or are going to Lama, we'll be there on the 18th. Do say hello because uh, we don't bite <coughs> and um, do you know what it's just so, so lovely to meet some people um, anyway uh, other than that oh look the CGI blokes over there again okay. I love our CGI anyway um, there isn't much more to add really uh, apart from it's blooming cold uh, but it's better than rain isn't it really I said I've got the hedge trimmer on I'm a bit worried about that I, I need to get that I'm gonna run out of time for hedge trimming which is a bit annoying um, got to get that done by the end of Feb right anyway apart from that I'm cracking on stay tuned I will be updating you on um, Facebook and uh, fingers crossed we sort this out it is a painful experience I can tell you that now all right well all the best to you tree planters and tree huggers and llama attendees and I don't know what else anyone is <laughs> I don't know CGI people and whatever Right, let's go. Oh, that's a funny thing, isn't it? Uh, you know, AI's in the news all the time, isn't it? AI this, AI that. I don't know, flipping it. I've been called, we've had an AI man coming here for 40 years, and now he's suddenly hip and trendy. But the trouble is, he sticks his hand up a cow's and And uh, CG, uh, AI's a bit different from that in the modern world, isn't it? Right, anyway, crack on. See you soon.